High up in the mountains, a tiny snowflake dances down from the sky. It's a baby snowflake, but actually, she's very old. In fact, she used to be dinosaur's breath. She's made of three little atoms, two of hydrogen and one of oxygen. Combined together, they make water. Lower the temperature, and hooray, it's a snowflake. Throughout the winter, the snowflakes gather high in the Rocky Mountains. They gather up high, becoming mighty water towers, waiting to slowly release their moisture in spring. In the spring, the little snowflake melts and seeps into the ground. Along the way, it might become a flower, a rainbow, or a drink of water for an animal. Finally, the little snowflake finds a creek, and the creek joins others to form the Old Man River. The river has many stops along the way. Lots of campers enjoy fishing and canoeing on it, up in the headwaters, before it flows down to the Old Man Dam. The dam holds some of the water back for times when we don't have rainy days. The river loops through Lethbridge and makes its way out near Tabor. There are 316 kilometers of irrigation that bring water from the river to the thirsty prairie. The irrigation equipment sends the snowflakes as droplets of water to each and every potato plant. Southern Alberta grows 760,000 tons of potatoes every year. If you stack the potatoes end to end, they would circle the earth five and a half times. It takes soil, sun, and plenty of clean, clear water to grow our food. And it takes many talented and dedicated farmers to look after the plants and our precious water supply. It's astonishing to think that the food we eat all comes from soil, sun, and the water from snowflakes. Growing food is the business of agriculture. That's the science of farming. You can grow your own garden too. Try planting a potato at home. It's fun and easy to do. In the fall, you can see big machines across southern Alberta as they move quickly to take the fully grown potatoes out of the ground before the frost comes. Water is everywhere, but it is not an endless supply, and that's why we don't want to waste food. Alberta potatoes are made into all kinds of tasty food. Thank you, farmers. So what will it be for supper tonight? French fries? Baked potatoes? What kind of potato did you eat today?